using your Android phone as a modem. If you want to use your Android handset as a modem, this video will show you how. You'll need to have Android software version 2.2 or later on your phone. To check what software version you're on, go to Settings, About Phone, Android version slash firmware version. To use your handset as a modem, you have two options. You can either connect securely, that is using a password, or unsecurely, without use of a password. It's up to you which way you choose to connect to the internet. If you intend doing online banking or sending emails with sensitive data, we'd recommend connecting securely. However, if you're just surfing the net, you might decide you don't need to do this. To connect unsecurely, press the Applications button on your Android phone. Select Settings. Select Wireless and Networks. If More Settings option is present, select this. Otherwise, select Tethering and Portable Hotspot. Select Portable Wi-Fi Hotspot. You should then see a confirmation message. Portable Hotspot Android AP Active. It needs to be ticked. On more recent software versions, you'll see the Configure button. Press OK. On your computer, you then need to search for available wireless networks. You'll then see a list of all wireless networks in your location. You'll need to select the handset to connect. You'll see that you are then connected. To use the internet, simply open your browser and off you go. To connect securely with a password, press the Applications button on your Android phone. Select Settings. Select Wireless and Networks. If More Settings option is present, select this. Otherwise, select Tethering and Portable Hotspot Settings. Select Configure Wi-Fi Hotspot. Enter the SSID. This is a name for the connection. Security select WPA2 PSK. Create a password for the connection, bearing in mind that it must be at least eight characters. Tick Show Password. Click on Save. Then go back to the Applications button on your Android phone. Select Settings. Select Wireless and Networks. If More Settings option is present, select this. Otherwise, select Tethering and Portable Hotspot. Select Portable Wi-Fi Hotspot. You should then see a confirmation message. Portable Hotspot Android AP Active. It needs to be ticked. On more recent software versions, you'll see the Configure button. Press OK. On your computer, you then need to search for available wireless networks. You'll then see a list of all wireless networks in your location. You'll need to select the handset to connect. You'll be prompted to enter the security key. This is the password you previously set. You'll see that you are then connected. Once again, to use the internet, simply open your browser and off you go. Surf's up. For more help and support, visit 3.ie forward slash support. Thanks for choosing 3.